Hello lovelies, it's Lex, and I just finished installing the new Sims 4 uh, Jungle Adventure game. That's the plan for basically all of today. Uh, I'm going to get out the Create a Sim video first. That's going to be this one. I'm going to do then the Build and Buy Mode Items video. I'm going to have that out as soon as I possibly can after the Create a Sim video. And then I might take a very short break to maybe get a snack or something, and then I'm planning on live streaming for a good portion of the rest of the day here. So this is our new opening screen here we have our couple of pictures that they cycle through and then it says venture to i think it's called selva dorada i think is what they're calling it so it says your sims can try traditional foods dance to new music practice native customs and shop for authentic decor dress your sims in local fashion from outfits full of colorful patterns to durable clothing suitable for the jungle. Uh, discover a hidden temple. Venture deep inside the mysterious rooms where sims may find priceless relics, great treasures, or doom. Have your sims visit again where they will experience new challenges and uncover different treasures or traps. So I'm pretty sure this is going to be really similar to World Adventure for Sims 3. But instead of having all the multiple different locations, there's just going to be one location that it seems like it's going to change maybe every time that you visit it. I'll explore the jungle. Sims can gear up in hiking attire and prepare for danger as they trek deep into the jungle, revealing hidden pools, ancient artifact sites, and ruins. Beware of natural dangers and obstacles from deadly bees to poisonous spiders. And then the last one says, uh, collect ancient artifacts. Sims can excavate and examine these precious objects closely at the archaeology table, determining their quality, but watch out for ones that are fake. So that's our new little pop-up here. This is our new starting screen and uh, I'm just gonna go right on in to the uh, create a sim items here and we will take a little look at them I'm pretty sure that we should have maybe some new um, personality traits as well mm. so let's go ahead and look at that first here so it looks like yet yeah, there's a new one in knowledge which is uh archaeology scholars so this in wants to understand archaeology so that's one of the new ones and there was also a new one in nature which is jungle explorer the sim wants to explore the jungle so that's pretty cool Let's see if we got any new actual personality traits here it doesn't look like it so we got a new one of these guys a new aspiration but no new personality traits i was thinking we might get a new personality trait like loves adventuring or you know something like that but it doesn't look like it let's go ahead and go into our hair first here let me see yeah jungle adventure there we go all right so we have this little short one that's pretty cute i like that a curly wavy short one with a headband obviously you guys know that the different colors are gonna change colors to the headband and everything like that one with a patterned headband here but it's the same as this and the same as the other little top bun but it's a like ombre colored hair here and obviously like I said before different colors are going to choose the different colors of the hair so that looks like all of the lady hairs here. Uh, looks like we got some new hats as well. We got a Indiana Jonesy kind of looking fedora type thing going on here. And then we got a more, I'll say, traditional um, old school archaeology adventurer hat there. I'm going to guess probably no new accessories because we, we haven't been getting... Um, new accessories lately so yeah no new no new accessories and most likely no new makeup either i haven't gotten new makeup in a long time all right let's check out our clothes here let's go ahead and get our pack situated there we go so we have a new dress super cute i actually really like that i really like the like ruffling on the bottom different colors looks like the top row has a few with the flower patterns and then the other ones are plain or variations on being plain and then we got a like i'm gonna say this is supposed to be the like female version for the jungle outfit even though i mean i would just wear pants but whatever so that's this one here it's all right it's interesting i like the green one because the belt's a different color all right 
So those are our dresses. No, nothing else in there. So let's see our new tops here. Usually the tops and the bottoms I have been more into than the um, like full body outfits. So you have this new halter tank top here. I really like this. Obviously, again, different colors. I do really like this one. This one's super cute. We have a new jacket shirt combo here. Also super cute. I love the different patterns on these ones. Oh, look at this pink one. Okay, I like this shirt the best so far. This one is super cute too. I really like the style of these shirts so far. I love this one. Another new tank top here. Nothing special with this one. Just a little V-necky tank top kind of thing. Again, very nice colors. I'm getting a lot of like Costa Rican kind of vibes from this one for some reason. Or like um, Spain kind of thing going on. Brazil maybe. I don't know. A more jungle appropriate <laughs> vest in my opinion. And then this poofy one here, which I'm not a huge fan of. I'm not a big fan of these like puffy sleeved shirts. Another more jungle appropriate kind of cargo shirt here. I really like this one. And then a, you know, little bit, little bit going on here. Jungle cargo top. Take a look at our pants. Hopefully we got some new pants. We did. All right. So here is a new floral skirt here. Very, very cute. Again, lots of different color and pattern options here. Oh, I really like this one. We got some new shorts here, a little bow on them. They're okay. They look pretty good with uh, this top, actually. Some new jungly capris here for adventuring. Oh, look at the pockets on some of these. The pockets have different colored inserts. That's cute. And then a, oh, this one has a little leg strap here. So this is super cute, too. I really like this one. And I love that these come in a lot of different colors and it changes the color of the leg strap. So that's nice. Let's see if we got any new body accessories here. No, not Parenthood, just Jungle Adventure, thanks. So let's take off her pants, sorry. So we got some new leggings here. I think these would look really cute under some of the shorts and the dresses. Oh, this is almost like a little aztec -y pattern. That's really nice, I like that. And then we got a new bracelet. Let me just zoom in there a little smidge here. With lots of different bracelet things going on. So that is pretty cute. And let's see if we got some new shoesies. I'm going to guess we should probably have some new boots. Yep, new boots. Oh, I love those actually though. Let's make them like, I don't know, like this yellow. Look at that. Those are super cute. I really like those. All right, let's turn you into a guy so we can see the right. men's stuff here. Let's see our new hair here. Uh, this looks very similar to the female hairstyle. Actually, these I'm pretty sure are exactly the same as the female hairstyle as well as this one. So we have three like unisex hairstyles and then one new one for the guys. It's super cute. I really like that one a lot, actually. I love when they add more wavy hairs. I feel like we don't have as many uh -huh. wavy hairs as we do, um, like, just straight hair. So I like that a lot. I'd love if we got some new facial hair, but doesn't look like it. Hats for the guys are exactly the same. Not a big surprise there. And... Ah... Uh no new accessories for the guys either here so let's go ahead and check out our guys clothes i think a lot of the stuff is going to be semi similar here so let's do our tops first i guess since i'm on that so we have a vest here same thing as with the ladies lots of different color options are changing up the the color patterns a lot which i really like this vest looks really similar to the one that the girls had i'm pretty sure it's it's, it's the same i'm pretty sure little cargo with a little with our little llamas on there this is very very cute I really like this one a lot and then a, a similar cargo top for the guys here to the ladies one as well another little shirt here really nice colors in this pack I love this like salmon -y color they've been using and then the guys get a sweatshirt here <coughs> I wish they had a sweatshirt the sweat same sweatshirt for the girls actually so that looks like our guys' tops. Uh, no full body outfits for the guys, it looks like. <coughs> Excuse my coughing. 
we'll take a look at our guy's pants. So it looks like we got, I'm going to take his shirt off so we can see the top of the pants here. So these almost look like jeans. Again, same, same color patterns here. Oh, look at the belt buckle with the little llama on it. So cute. All right, and then we got some like more capri wrapped up pants for the guys here, which I'm not a big fan of. And then that same pair of like adventures pants as the girls with the little side pack. Doesn't look like any new accessories for the guys. And probably the exact same boots. Yeah, so exact same boots for the guys here. Let's go ahead and make you a child and just see if there is any new stuff for the kids here. So no new hairs for the kids, but we did get a new hat. Very cute with little, little llama patterns on there. So that's something. And I'm sure we did get some new clothes. So new tops for the boy kids here. Really similar to the just men's top with the vest. And a new t-shirt here that, in my opinion, almost looks like a soccer t-shirt, possibly, because it has the little, like, llama emblem in numbers on the back. So that's what I would guess that that one is. No new full bodies for the kids, and no new pants for the kids. And the kids don't get the boots. So let's switch you back to a little girl. See if we got any new hairs for little girls. No new hairs. Same hat. And we have the same like soccer or sports shirt for the girls, but a different other top, which is adorable. This little cardigan with the birds on it. I really like that. No new full bodies, which is kind of odd to me because usually they do a dress for the girls here that matches one of the women's dresses. No new pants either. And no boots for the kids either. So... I'm going to guess that this is about it. The teen stuff is usually exactly the same as the adult stuff. That's what it looks like to me. Uh, in Sims 3, they used to have the teen attire be slightly different. There were some that were that were the same for both adults and teens, but uh, in this one, usually the teen stuff and the adult stuff is the same. So I think that that's going to be it for our create a sim. Let me make a... A dog real quick here just in case there is something I don't know if there is I guess if there is it would be under the like accessories uh I don't know it's not really letting it's not letting me filter it no I think that's it I think that's, uh, I think that's it. No new pet stuff either, which would, that would have been kind of, like, odd, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's going to be it for our creative sim items here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, stay tuned. This dog is cross-eyed. <laughs> stay tuned for the uh, build and buy mode items. I'm going to have that video out shortly here. And hopefully I'll see everybody in the live stream later on tonight. But yeah, have a great rest of your day, guys. And I'll see you in uh, just a little bit with another video.